hello guys how's it going i hope everything is well so in this video we are going to talk about class 9th physical science chapter number 7 atoms molecules and chemical reactions so this is our chapter 7 and in this chapter we are going to see the question answer of this chapter okay so first of all moving to the our answer let's see the some question and then we will move to the our answer okay so first of all you have to see the question then we will see the answer right so let's move to the question which question is given here so we have to see that one okay after that we will move to the our answer all right so let's see the question okay so if you come here your chapter is ending here after that the keywords is starting okay so in this chapter there is a we will talk about keywords which is given here after the keywords we will talk about what we have to learn okay in this actually there is a lots of the um, improve your learning i mean uh this key in uh, important points is given in your test book okay now and also we will see in our workbook also there is also the important points is given after that here let us improve learning let us improve learning means nothing what is a question answer only so reflection of concept in reflection of concept there is a totally eight question uh, if you have any doubt then uh, if you have test book then match this okay now and after that here fill in the uh, fill in the flowing tables is it there is a 14 question in that and then application of concept in this there is two question higher thinking question in this there is a three question and after that multiple choice question in multiple choice question there is a five multiple choice question okay so after that suggested experiments in this one 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 is given here and suggested project work also one okay so this is uh, our uh, test book whatever uh, keyboards question answer and multiple choice question everything is we already see okay now so i hope this is a clear for you so if it is clear then now let's move to the our answer all right so as you can see this is our answer sheet chapter number seven atoms molecules and chemical reactions so we already see the question now we have to see the answer right so first of all moving to the keywords let's see the key concept uh, key concept means important points okay now so is it important points is already given in your textbook also is it here also so i show you because lots of the children write the key concept because of that i am showing so if you want to be also right so you can write otherwise just skip it okay now so uh i hope is it clear after that if you come then mind mapping so mind mapping is very important because lots of the children recommend me to show the mind mapping because of the time showing okay now mostly 10th class student but this is not 10th class it's 9th class only now and 9th class only but i'm showing you because if you just uh, if you understand the mind mapping then it's very you know it is something other moment for you so remember that one okay after that our keywords okay keywords means word meaning is starting from here keywords is starting from here and that's the first keywords law of conservation of mass law of const uh, constant proportion okay now atom symbols atomic mass you know my screen is totally broken and because of that i didn't see the clearly things yes. okay now so uh it's a keyword and uh, if you want to write whole keywords you can write and the keywords which you want to write you can write otherwise a keyword which you don't want to write so don't write okay it's depend on you which keyword you want to write which keyword you don't want to write so you just look for that which one you have to go into write and which one you don't want to be right okay now so everything is depend on you so i hope this one is a clear all right so if it is 12th is complete then come to the next one because uh, we have to see lots of the question answer also okay now all right i hope is it a clear then come to the 16 this is the formula mass and moles okay this is a keywords also okay is that keywords and uh, we want to be right so you can be right all right okay so if it is complete and comes let's see there okay so if it is complete then just come to the downwards there is a, uh, actually you know there is a lots of a keyword is given in that one so which keyword you want to write so write it okay and i totally is it a very difficult lots of a question and uh, lots of the keyword is given okay now every keyword is very important so 
if you don't want to create keywords don't write but remember that one uh, what is mean by that one okay now suppose what is the mean by like uh, red x reaction okay now remember if you don't write in your notebook then remember that what is the red x reaction so if you study carefully then you definitely you will be learn everything so i uh, i'm also trying to bring the lecture of the, your physics textbook and uh, maths mathematics okay now but uh, not soon as it possible it's not be common but uh, as soon as it possible definitely i will bring okay now so after it here improve your learning improve your learning this is our reflection of concept question answer okay now, and this is your first question explain the process of uh, percolating of the verification of law of conservation of mass okay and this is the answer of that one okay so i hope is it a clear so if it is clear then this is a first question answer only okay now don't be confused so uh, if you skip the video when i'm showing question answer then you will confuse somewhere not all time if you skip you will confuse no not like that but somewhere you will get confusion so if you get confusion then just go come to the back and watch like uh, series wise okay now don't be confused okay so i hope this one is clear so if it is clear then come to the here this is your second question and answer is it here all right okay so i hope is it clear for you so if it is clear then come to the third one and this is your third question all right so if it is complete then come to the fourth one and this is your fourth question answer okay and this is the fourth one answer only three and four Co stands for the coplet and element. This can be identified with the help of the C has capital upper cases later and the O is more lower cases later. Okay. And after that, this is your fifth question and answer is it. Okay. And uh, then after is it your sixth question and answer is given. Easily you can see that one. okay so if it is complete then come to the seventh one and this is your seventh question uh, just see the question if question is clear then come to the answer and this is your answer of seventh one okay and convert into molecules this is your eighth question okay so this is your eighth question so in this uh, there is lots of a chance that you will confuse so just see the question and uh, uh, just see in your textbook also which question is it okay otherwise you will get confused okay bc is here all right so let's go next and this is your ninth question uh, write the balance of the Fe and FeCl and uh, ferrous chloride only. This is a ferrous chloride, ferrous chloride, ferrous chloride is FeCl. Okay, you know, chemistry is very boring for me. I didn't understand chemistry. <laughs> if I understand the physics, I didn't understand the chemistry. If I understand the chemistry, I didn't understand the physics there's a lot of confusion actually you know if you understand the physics then physics is easy when you understand and chemistry is out of syllabus it is not for all the people but lots of the people get confused why this happened but actually you know this is all the mistakes of our teacher we who didn't explain you clearly uh, we are the peak of any subject there is a two reason there is a first reason in our we are not practicing and the second reason is teacher that didn't teach you clearly that's one okay that's a different topic is it and 12 question is fill in the uh, fill in the flowing tables okay and the answer is it here okay i 
I hope is it clear for you okay so if it is clear then uh, let's come to the 13 that's your 13 answer okay and this is your 14 question and the answer is it here something answer is it onwards also let's see that one okay okay so if it is complete then come to the 51 this is your 15 question answer okay after that uh, this is your 16 question answer all right so after that uh, this is your 17 okay and this is your 18 question answer and then after is it your 19 and then after is it your 20 I hope this one is clear so if it is one clear then come to the application of concept in application of concept this is your first question why do we apply paint on iron uh, atels okay now actually my screen is not visible that's why that's what is not clearly that is the atel something okay now so this is your answer okay if it is clear then come to the second one this is your second question what is the use of keeping the food in air tight tight container okay and this is the answer all right so if it is complete then uh, let's come to the higher order thinking question and this is a higher order thinking question and that's the first question uh, you will match with your textbook also if you get doubt and then after this is the answer of that one so i have to make something small for that one okay so if it is clear then this is your second question carbon dioxide is added to 112 grams of a carbon dioxide okay now calcium dioxide not the carbon dioxide okay now one uh, one one two gram of calcium oxide okay and is it answer after that uh, it's also answer this is the answer of two uh, by law of conservation of mass this is our second uh, second question answer is it okay so if it is complete come to the third one and this is your third question and answer I hope is also, uh, it's also complete so if it is complete then come to the suggested experiment and this is your suggested experiment and that's uh, the first question and answer is it here uh, you can easily see all right okay so let's go next one this is experiment only okay now all right so i hope it is clear then come to the here if you come here you can say this is a suggested project work okay now and this is project work and this is the answer of that one all right So I hope is it one clear for you. So if it is complete and you just see that one also. Magnesium, aluminium, silicon, phosphorus, sulfur, chlorine, organ, potassium, calcium, scandium, titanium, brandium, chromium, magnesium, ferrum, carbon, nickel, copper, zinc. This is a 13 element. Okay now. I remember till 13. <laughs> okay. So project work is also completed okay now so in this chapter uh, whatever is it question answer keywords uh, key points and uh, uh, project work experiment higher thinking question everything whatever in this chapter is totally completed okay so our chapter number seven is totally completed all right so we will meet the next video jai hind